Hello students, this video will show you how to work with images and video. Images are graphic pictures that you can insert into a document. You can get images from many places, iPhoto, the web, a folder, or a picture gallery. Let's insert two pictures into this Word document. The first picture will be from Word's clip art gallery. The first thing I'll do is I will move my mouse and click where I'd like the picture to go. The blinking cursor creates a target for my image. Then I'll go up to the Insert menu, go down to Clip Art, choose Clip Art Browser, and I'd like to pick a picture of an apple for my document. I see an image of an apple here. I'm going to hold my mouse down and I will drag the image and let go. Now my image is in my document but it's a little big. I'm going to resize it by selecting the image. I'll click on it and I'll move to a corner where I see there's an arrow. If I hold my mouse down and on a diagonal drag it towards the center, the image will get smaller. I'll let go and now my image is the size I want it to be. I'll click on the document to deselect it and X out of my gallery. The next image that I'm going to put in, I'm going to actually drag it in from the desktop. I have a picture here of an apple pie. I'll move down to the bottom, click and press return twice, and I think I want to center it. I'll press the center tab. Now I'm ready to drag my apple pie into my document. I'll hold the mouse down. I'll drag the image down. I see that's where the cursor is. Let go. Great. This is the right size, so I'm not going to resize this apple pie, but I do want to move it. I think I'm going to move it to the top, and that's easy to do. I'll hold my mouse down and start to drag the image up. As you can see, the cursor moves, and that's where the image will go. I want to move it all the way up to the top, so I'm still holding my mouse down. And right there, I want to have the apple pie right next to that apple, so I'm going to let go. Great. However, I think I'm going to get rid of this apple. That's easy to do. I'll click on it to select it and press the delete button. Now my image is right where I want it to be. If I want to insert a movie into the document, it's pretty much the same way. Let's go to the end of the document, press the return key twice, and I have a movie here on my desktop that I can drag into my document. I'll hold the mouse down and drag the movie down and let go. It takes a little bit because the movies are bigger. Oh, the movie moved up to the top, but that's easy to fix. You can see it's selected, so what I'll do is move to the corner to find that arrow, hold my mouse button down, and drag it towards the middle to make that movie smaller. I'll hold my mouse button down, and then I can just drag the movie down to the bottom. Great. So now I have an embedded movie in my document and an image on the top. There's other ways to add movies and videos to documents, such as a wiki, which is a web-based page, and that's covered in another video. But for this, meanwhile, this is videos and images, and thanks for watching.